Well, hello, and welcome to Kids Ministry Tools. In this video, we're going to talk about the armor of God while it's being drawn. Let's get started. So, the first thing that God lists in the armor of God is the belt, or the loins girt about with truth. So, it's very important to know what the truth is. God is truth, and the Word of God is truth. It's very important to understand that God is true. Let God be true and every man a liar. God is true. And he says that his word is true. God does not want to lie to us. And then we have the breastplate of righteousness. This protects our heart. It protects our main organs. (laughs) But also it is very important to cover the main part of the body with righteousness. And then he talks about your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace, always prepared to tell others about Jesus. And then the shield of faith. It is very important to have faith. Faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. So having the shield of faith, we grow in faith by listening to the Word of God. Faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the Word of God. What's after that? You got it, the helmet of salvation. Salvation is by grace, through faith, alone in Jesus Christ. The Bible says in John 14, 6, Jesus saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Salvation is only through Jesus. And then the last one is the sword of the Spirit. I love this one. The sword of the Spirit, which is the Word of God. Isn't that neat? Well, here we have it. The whole armor of God. That is found in Ephesians chapter 6, verses 10 through 20. He says to put on the whole armor of God, every last bit of it from the head to the toe. I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and bye-bye.